Well, now you know there's been debate on the mobile money tax. It was uh, allegedly pushed to 0 0.5, but then, well, it had already started, you know, we had already started collecting. I'm saying <laughs> you are A and I. <laughs> well, you are A collected 103 billion shillings from mobile money tax in the three months out of the targeted 100. 51 billion shillings in the first quarter of the 2018-2019 financial year. Now, this is before the 0.5%. Paul Busharizi, welcome to the show. Thank you. Uh, so, <laughs> what, what could have happened? Is this because uh, of the, the, the controversial tax? Is it uh, because there was a, a debate on these things? No, obviously it's the way the the tax was levied, especially in the first, I think, to the first three days, where, um, uh, if I remember, they were placing one percent on sending, receiving, receiving, and withdrawing, and withdrawing. Yes. Yes. So then uh, a communication came, I think, from URA or the ministry that that's not the way it should be done. Mm -hmm. We only uh, tax on withdrawing. Mm -hmm. That was one percent, mm -hmm. um, but uh, the damage kind of had been done and yeah. all that kind of business, and um, so so it's no surprise that um, we've fallen short. However, I'm sup I'm actually impressed that it didn't fall much further uh, short than than it is. I mean, mm. uh, forty eight billion. You said um, they they collected billion. one three one zero three. And uh, they were supposed, they were supposed to create uh, rather collect one fifty one. Yeah, so forty eight billion. Shortfall is not a small amount it's of not money, a small, but uh, yeah. I, I thought actually thought it would be worse, mm. especially that, the initial really confusion. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. But well, the URA Public Affairs Manager says uh, the reviews and debates on the tax could have affected the collection. Uh, yes, of course. I mean, you know, people. Bl I don't know. I don't know. Say they blew it out of proportion, mm. but they, they they actually built it up to a bigger thing than than, <laughs> than it should be. I mean. Uh, if I'm sending, uh, by the way, the majority of transactions are yeah. small transactions. Mm -hmm. You're talking about uh, 20,000, you know, yeah. below you know 100,000. Yeah. So let's assume you send 100,000. You know, the, the, the tax on 100,000, even at 1%, is 1,000 shillings. I mean, you can't really be splitting hairs about uh, <laughs> 1,000 shillings. Um, of course, the argument is, uh, mm. you know, why should there be a tax? But you see, the people who are, who are thinking about this tax said, look, this like uh, this is uh, so. This is 2018. In mm. 2017, I think about 54 trillion shillings uh, zoomed around the the the, the mobile money uh, ecosystem. Yeah. 54 trillion shillings, and the and the pl and the planners or whoever wow. are wondering. But this economic activity, it's, it's not being registered mm -hmm. in our tax revenues because clearly something is happening. Yeah. We know, of course, that. Um, 70% of our economy, uh, up to 70% of our economy is in the informal sector. People who don't pay tax, people who are unregistered. But they are doing stuff. Yes. Uh, and, and look, what is tax? Tax, as they say, is the cost of, of, um, of, of, of uh, civilization. Every one of us uses a road. Mm. Every one of us, uh, we might not uh, want to believe it, but we benefit from the security in the country. Sure. Uh, every one of us, uh, you know, benefits from even the uh, the way the economy is is, is kind of stable or what that that's a cost that has to come from the taxpayer mm. so you can't stand there and say that ah no we shouldn't pay taxes you're frustrating <laughs> business but who uh, <laughs> that business you you're saying we're frustrating if the if if the tax was not really doing its work there would be no business to begin with well well uh, your is uh, supposed to collect about 16 trillion in the financial year yeah. and uh, I'm wondering is this going to affect the second quarter do you think it will be the same the between October and December no no I don't think so first of all of course we need to maybe urge the president to sign the 0.5% 0 .5 0 0 yes 0 0.5 into law because it's we're still paying one percent. I'm wondering why he's taking long. Yet he, he <laughs> I think people are hiding the papers. You know, <laughs> we, we want this. We want as much revenue as possible. I so, know. I mean, joking aside, you can. Yeah. You know. But yeah, that's the first thing. I think the president has to sign it off uh, mm. into law zero point five percent. But I, I expect. I mean, mobile money has become such an integral part of our lives. <laughs> We're not going to boycott it. Like, we've 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 sucked and, uh, and 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 done our huffing and puffing. We're going to get back onto it. I expect that you know taxes will 
will come back on you know, mm. the foregoing part of the year, the yes, foregoing yes. part of the financial year, yes. So I, th I actually think that Ugandans, you just have to keep quiet. Put just the tax, the ad <laughs> move and on. Enforce. And they will do it. Yeah. Well, th the thing is, and you know, that's, I, I am beginning to believe, or well, I think I've believed for some time that the traditional tax way of getting tax, mm. a man has an income, he declares yeah. income, then he tax income, might not be uh, practical for an economy that is very informal like ours. Oh, yes. As yes. we shift towards informality, of course, that happens. But we can't wait to shift to informality mm. to collect the tax. So we have to find other ways. That's why you have, um, there's even, a, people have forgotten, but there's a tax on every liter of fuel. Why have we why have we forgotten that and we're just of course, because we, we <laughs> it, do, it doesn't show somehow. <laughs> so oh, well. that that is that goes towards the road fund, mm -hmm. which helps in building the roads. Yeah, we've got those indirect taxes now with with mobile money, mm -hmm. and even the beers we drink and what the and the social media tax they kept the quiet about. Social media tax, yeah. I mean, look, let's let's pay our dues. Exactly. We want. We, we, we watch TV, we see first class uh, living standards, roads, power, you know, security. That's what we want for ourselves, but we don't want to pay. You know, I wrote a few weeks ago that everyone wants to go to heaven, but no one wants to die. <laughs> you know, because, you know, in this case, yeah, going to heaven is a good life you wish for, and dying is paying the taxes. We, need, we, we really need to pay our taxes. Yeah, absolutely. I, I, I really I support no it. Uh -uh. For people who I are don't. All sorts because of stuff. we want good things, yet we don't want to pay yeah, for absolutely. them. Well, thank you, Paul. You're welcome. <laughs>